So the steps you want to take after an accident with a delivery truck are very similar to those that you want to take after a regular car accident. You obviously want to get the information of the other driver, maybe take a snapshot of their license plate, um, any pictures you can take at the scene if you're not too injured, if you're being hauled off by an ambulance. Obviously, you want someone who has called 911 to get the police on the scene to be doing all that information gathering. Um, but a couple of different things you need to do if you have in, an accident with a delivery truck would be to find out if the company um, requires the driver to have a uh, video camera going uh, either interior or exterior or both um, because you'll want to get that footage right away. And um, another thing is you need to identify what company, who's the employer, who's the owner of the truck. I mean, these are all things um, that I would encourage you to find a lawyer who's uh, experienced with delivery truck accidents um, right away, like m sooner than you would in a uh, normal accident case because of the investigation issues, um, preserving the evidence with the videos and tracking down um, who owns the truck and who's responsible. Um, for example, we had a case uh, with a delivery truck where um, our client didn't contact us till several months after the accident, and it was quite an uphill battle trying to find out uh, who owned the truck, who um, leased the truck, who uh, hired the employee who was driving the truck, and uh, tracking down. There was no police report, um, no accident report of any kind, so we had a lot of uh, digging to do a little late in the game. So I would encourage you to contact um, a delivery truck uh, accident lawyer ASAP.